Contractors with Des Moines Continental Joint Venture have completed 32% of a Savannah Harbor expansion project feature to remove the 1970s era tide gate structure. Here, workers use a wire cutter to break the structure into smaller pieces. In addition to removing the tide gate structure, contractors will return the back river to its original width. To accomplish this, excavators and dump trucks collect and position material near the river's edge where a hydraulic cutter head dredge pumps it across the river into a designated dredge material containment area. This feature is part of the flow rerouting activities included in the SHEP mitigation plan in order to protect freshwater wetlands and the Savannah National Wildlife Refuge. Construction began in November 2016 and is expected to be completed in December of this year.